So hello guys, welcome back to another tutorial. Today's tutorial is going to be on the Streamlabs chatbot. So let's just open this up right here. So the first thing you want to do is go to connections, which is right here. We want to go to YouTube streamer. So that's your own account. YouTube bot. You can be your same account, but I generalize, I generally put it on a different account on YouTube. I haven't set this up for Twitch before, so I think it's the same aspect, but I'm not too sure. So this is going to be for YouTube. So I use two accounts, but you can use the same account. It still works the same way. So let's go into it and let's get it um, connected. So generate token. This will bring it bring it up so you can uh, log in so I'm gonna blur the screen right now just so you can't see my login details so there we go that's the first account getting messages that's the first account on there and um, that is my account what we'll be streaming off so we will allow it to do all its thing we we'll press connect that says success so far lay connected. Now we go to the YouTube bot, which I use a different account for this, um, as you've probably seen on my live streams, it is Music Live 24-7. So guys, we're gonna generate token for as bot account. Um, same again, we just allow it. And then we connect, and it will say here, Sussex fairly connected. Sorry with my pronunciations, they're not very good. So now what you'd want to do is go ahead, set up some commands for yourself. It, it works exactly the same as Nightbot, but with this one, you don't have to separate out. So command, we're going to say uh, test, and what that will bring back is working. Obviously, you can put this whatever you want to. Submit. So guys, just to show that this is working. We just type in here, test, and it comes back working, so we know that that is working. And timers are basically things that will pop up every so often after so many lines of chat or after some time kind of thing. What you do with these, you go to the plus sign, add in a name, we're just going to go test, working, one, submit it, and that's all you have to do guys. So next one. Your giveaway is a good one. If you want people to join a raffle and stuff for uh, giveaway games, basically all you do, command, you can set that to anything, but I keep it standard, exclamation mark raffle. Tell them the prize. Tell them how much the tickets are going to cost. Um, how many tickets are allowed. Open giveaway, yeah. Bit self-explanatory, that one. Let's have a look here. Currency. This is, well, if you turn it on, this is. Um, this is where you chat can uh, gain points for the like the giveaway and other things um to get on top of it leaderboard i think a minute on mine is mr rotten gaming with twelve thousand points and then it's masses so yeah so and so forth uh, these are all the people that are in your uh, streams mini games i love this one myself heist it basically it's another thing can joined with the uh, currency it'll cost you so much to buy into the game kind of thing the little game and then if you win it'll give you a mount back bit self-explanatory but yeah i have them all on myself you don't have to but i do yeah these are all self-explanatory mod tools uh, i did have a person yesterday come up to me and say uh, i'm still using my bot because chatbot do not use have mod tools well that's where you're wrong it does if you're wanting cap protection on so people don't stamp spam caps and stuff turn it on there symbol protection exactly the same as nightbot but just a lot better pro what better uh layout i think in a program that's my thoughts anyway link protection and word protection you know you can ban certain words from your chat and um, can have purge timeout or ban for any of them depending on your preference i'll just purge it so it means it'll get rid of it but i don't have them on because i've got moderators that i'll deal with that kind of stuff so i don't really need them on and yeah guys that's a general tutorial of this 
um, Streamlabs chatbot. It's a very simple page to get to know, a uh, program to get to know. Um, another thing, you do have to have it open while you are streaming, otherwise it won't work. I think that's only probably one of the downsides, but it's still a good program. Here, this I can type as me, or I can put it to bot and type as the bot, as, as you can see. So yes, guys, thank you for uh, watching this video. If you've liked it, please smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, and give me a comment down below. Thank you, guys, and I will catch you all on the next one.